Hey, what's up guys? Wolfcopter here, and before this video starts, I was just gonna ask you guys a quick favor. My girlfriend's mom's horse uh, recently took a fall out in the pasture. They're not sure exactly what it was doing, but it, uh, they thought that it sprained its ankle. Turns out that it was not a sprain, and it was actually a ruptured perianus tertitius. Uh, which basically means the muscle separated from the bone down at the ankle and unless they can get it fixed the horse will be completely unrideable for the rest of its life um, they're hoping they can uh, get some uh, stem cell reconstruction work done obviously that's not going to be cheap so, my girlfriend has set up a GoFundMe page um, at this link. Um, if you guys could go and show some support, or to give a few dollars, anything helps. Um, I would be really appreciative, and if you do, I'll find some special way to uh, thank you in one of my videos. My 200th video is coming up pretty soon. Hopefully I can uh, do something in that for you. Anyways, hope you guys enjoy the video. Thank you all so much for listening to this little spiel beforehand. Wolfcopter out. <laughs> What's up guys? Wolfcopter here once again. Back on this floating ship, wouldn't really say floating actually, in Fallout 4, and we're going to the Brotherhood. We are going to the Brotherhood right to goddamn now. Remember in the last episode when I said, man, that kind of looks like Liberty Prime. Or maybe I just thought it, I don't remember. But I it, it was looking over at the airport, and I'm like, huh, that kind of looks like Liberty Prime. Well, I just saw what the quest is called. As soon as this is done loading, I will show you what the quest is called. But suffice to say, I am really excited because Liberty Reprimed. Liberty fucking prime liberating the commonwealth is a huge responsibility shut up we'll liberty prime so i bet you're eager to get your hands dirty on our new project how much has maxon told you about absolutely it? nothing except the name why all the secrecy we're pouring every resource we have into this thing we can't risk tipping off the institute for now the fewer people that know about it the better Come on, it's this way. Unless you're blind as a bat, I'm sure you've noticed that we've been building a gantry on the tarmac. Maxon and Kells have been looking for something that'll tip the balance when we go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Institute. Now, the Pridwin might be a big beast, but she's not built for fighting. Okay. That's where our new project comes in. Is it Liberty Prime? Please tell me it's freaking Liberty Prime. I've missed Liberty Prime. Oh my god, it's fucking Liberty this Prime. storage bay full of parts is what's left of Liberty Prime. Oh, oh yes! As a weapon against the Enclave. It's the most advanced robot the Brotherhood has ever had at its disposal. Unfortunately, Liberty Prime was destroyed in the line of duty. Yes, it was. I spent the better part of the last few years piecing him back together. And if you think that was easy... Try rebuilding a Protectron while you're blindfolded. I could probably do it. In order to get Liberty Prime fully operated, before you run off, maybe you should listen to your orders. This robot isn't going to build itself. One moment. I am doing things. Called searching. I'm going to loot this place, and then we can talk. Cool, cool. Okay, Roger. sorry. In order to get Liberty Prime fully operational, we're going to need your help. Okay. No problem. No problem. 
I'm sure this only looks worse than it actually is. Huh. I wish I had your confidence. Because this is not going to be easy. Now, the good news is that we've got most of Prime's parts fully assembled. Okay. The bad news is that it's going to take more than a few rivets and some spot welding to get them working again. The first problem is his CPU. It's fragile, and every time we try to feed power to it, it blows itself out. Right. Uh, Why power is the power blowing out his CPU? Liberty Prime has a highly complex power system. And it's been damaged. The deal of that system was damaged when he exploded. So I'm working in the dark trying to come up with parts on my own. Luckily, you were able to convince Dr. Madison Lee to return to the Brotherhood. She was on the original build team for Liberty Prime a little bit. Oh, uh, yeah, she was. I've already spoken to her, but she's reluctant to work on Prime for some reason. If you could get her down here to lend a hand with his power system, we can get the big guy moving. All right. Where's Dr. Lee? Because one thing I do love is friggin' Liberty Prime. Liberty Prime was the coolest freaking thing in uh, Fallout 3. The Institute and their technological abominations need to be stopped at any cost. Hesitating to pull the trigger on any of the Commonwealth scum can be failed. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I went the complete wrong direction. Where the heck am I going? Aha, here we go. Oh, we just need to go to the Pridwin. Well, screw taking the vertebrate. I'm just gonna fast travel. Fast traveling is fun. Oh my god, Liberty Prime! I am so excited about friggin' Liberty Prime. I have not seen friggin' Liberty Prime since Fallout 3. And he was awesome back then, and he's gonna be even more awesome now. Give me Liberty Prime. Right now. Dr. Lee, I swear to God, if you do not help with Liberty Prime... Attention. Tomorrow's tactical briefing has been postponed. A new time and date will be forthcoming. Where are you? If there you are. If you're here to talk me into working on Liberty Prime, you can forget it. Why? You promised you'd help us. You're right, I did. But you neglected to mention that I'd be asked to work on Liberty Prime. I didn't know! I've been down this road with the Brotherhood before. Why would I make the same mistake twice? Uh, reluctance Why to help. won't you help us with Liberty Prime? I originally left the Brotherhood because I was tired of being stepped on and used. First, there was the water purification project, designed to freely benefit the entire Capital Wasteland. Right. Even though the Brotherhood allowed it to be activated, they wanted to control it. But that wasn't enough. They forced me to help design Liberty Prime. Turned my work into a weapon of war. I, had I mean, he was already... Left. Built before you ever got there. Uh, save because the Commonwealth. We care what happens to the Commonwealth. You know, if anyone else wearing a Brotherhood of Steel uniform said something like that, I'd laugh in their face. But coming from you, it sounds like you actually. I do. Tell Proctor Ingram to get her scribes ready. It's going to take a hell of a lot of work to get Liberty Prime back online. But we well, get it done. that was easier than I thought. Don't despair, sister. We're here to save the Commonwealth. That was actually way nice easier. Work bringing Dr. Lee back into the fold. Now, there's something you need? Yes. I want to see what I'm you have. For some... Be my guest. Sure. Show me what you got. Minigun. Gatling laser. Oh. Wait. This thing runs on fusion cores. How much does it weigh? 20 pounds. Ah. Uh. Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't know. Oh, I can sell that shit. And that, and that. And all those. And that. Ah, it's good, but it's not that good. Super Sludge! Oh, synth relay grenades. I think those summon a synth to me. I can't not get it. I can't not get the friggin' Gatling laser. Uh, put it on eight. Oh my god, that thing looks badass. If you run into any synths, what can I do to it? Kill. We don't take prisoners. Uh. Okay, standard barrel, charging barrel. Huh. Reflex sight. Beam focuser. Oh my god, this thing is gonna be friggin' beautiful. Surgical tray. Damn it. If you find any technical documents, you should bring them to Dr. Dr. Tegan. Can I help you with anything? Uh, I need to. Got some. If this thing runs off a, a fusion cores. Gonna need a couple. Sell that. Uh, okay, two. Maxon might appear compassionate. But I can assure you, the Institute will face his wrath. <sighs> it was a bad idea buying this thing. Unless you like getting shot, never turn your back on a gunner. I will keep that in mind. Now where was you? you? Expected Dr. Lee would return to the brother. Are the documents you want? Documents. Found some These look rather. Here are the caps that I promised. Remember, the con check yes. every building you explore. Yes, thank you. Goodbye. Freaking Gatling laser. I've got one of those too. Oh my god, it's gonna be so cool. And it runs on friggin' fusion cores. I guess I can't really just use it forever. Although I was kind of hoping it would just run on regular ammo. Yeah, loading screens. All right, Proctor. You know those scents with the plastic faces? They creep me the hell. Same with me. Proctor Ingram. Wow. Things are off to a good start. Isn't that right, Doctor? I hope so. Prime suffered some significant damage to his memory core. I wish your people would have been a bit more careful, Proctor. 
The good news is that the damage isn't irreversible, and I should be able to get the power flow. Oh, this the thing! Core without overloading. If your people. I was thinking that weapons. looked like Liberty Prime. But this is Charming, Liberty Prime. Isn't she? Uh. Sorry about yeah. that. Yeah. Sorry about that, Ingram. Don't worry about it. We might be butting heads on a few issues, but I've dealt with worse. Like losing your legs. Besides, Doctor Lee's worth all the aggravation. We're working with one of Prime's original designers. I don't see it getting any better than that. In True. Fact, since things are going so well, we're gonna have you start building his electromagnetic actuators. His what? Oh. What do the actuators do? Pretty simple, really. The actuators are what allows Liberty Prime's arms and legs to move. Okay. Prime's new limbs are way too heavy for the simple hydraulic pistons he had in the past. We're gonna have to rip those out, construct a brand new system using electromagnets, and install them in his limbs. What okay. we need you to do is build the actuators for him. You know what the actuators are, you need to know how to make them. These are the plans and the materials list. Don't lose them. Now before you get that look on your face, you'll be happy to know that we have plenty of the raw materials on that list right here at the airport. All the right. only thing we need you to head out and find is a high-powered magnet. Oh, that's easy. Quinlan, the best place to find one is in any of the ruined hospitals around the Commonwealth. We've already sent out a few teams to find the rest of the high-powered magnets you'll need. They should be back by the time you return. Oh, Once that's you start easy. Building the actuators. We need one for each limb, so you'll need to make a total of four. Good luck. All right. Hail night. That should be very and simple. Carry food with you, or you'll end up eating some pretty questionable things to stay. All right. Let's go there after I go grab my power armor. Ah, uh, feral ghouls. Yes, they are not zombies. I think that might be kinder. All right, to my power armor. Actually, dance. Dance, where the fuck are you? You know what? Since Don't care. I'm feeling swell. Look at the two of us here in sanction. Store all my junk. Ah, I need to do that. For the future. Can I? Nah, still need more ceramic. But can I? Yes, I can. I can make that. A targeting HUD. And let's add a bright headlamp. And nice. Oh. Oh. I got to go with that. Okay, so leg, so leg. What can the arms do? I would need blacksmith for that. Okay, but that's friggin' awesome. Hop on in. See what we can do. What's my carrying capacity now? 460. Nice. Hi. 
How are you? Huh? Ah. Targeting HUD. That is going to be so handy. That it is friggin' ridiculous. Alright, now for the fun part of trying to get all of this off of this. Or all of this off of this. God damn it. Uh, that standard magazine, standard sights, and no muzzle. Okay. Ah, I could give it that. I have a lot of 50 caliber bullets. I'm going to do that. All right, it's got the long barrel already. Marksman stock. Large magazine, long scope, and a suppressor. And let's see what we can do with this thing. What's the maximum power we can give it? Okay, so we need more science for that. Yeah. So right now, it seems like it's not really worth carrying it. And that's what I'm getting right now. Thus, I'm going to store it. Gatling laser, that thing, that. How's my weight doing now? Excellent. I wish I knew we thinkers in oversized noggins. Not often a recipe for civility. Oh my god, I can see so much! Oh yeah, I should check my uh, workbench. Transfer. So much purified water. 130 bottle caps. Alright. Now we go down to the red rocket. Pick up dog meat. And then we're off. We're gonna do a thing. I'm excited. Boy. Hmm? Let's go. Boy. It's time to go. Worf. All right. To the hospital. Where we're going to find a thing. An electromagnet. Yes, an electromagnet. 
And we have so much friggin' carrying capacity now. Good lord. It's awesome. Oh yeah, I need to go get the alien blaster still as well. Remind me to do that in one episode. Also, tell me where the alien blaster is so I can go get it. Or I could just look it up. Oh yeah, I need to, uh, favorite. Uh, six. Why? Why are you here? And why are you not attacking me? That's odd. Oh my god, this targeting HUD makes it so nice. I can just see every living thing. Oh, of course, because I'm part of the Institute. I'm part of the Institute, so now they have no reason to attack me. Nice. That is actually really freaking nice. Alright, got plenty of fusion cores. Ooh, a death call hand. Uh. No, 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 no. No need to get up. You're fine, right where you are. Please don't. Please don't. Oh, oh boy. Dog. No, dog meat. You really think your ears are playing tricks on you? Like, I know you're friggin' dumb and all. But seriously? A nuke went off. A freaking nuke. I don't care how bad your hearing is. You're not gonna, your ears aren't going to deceive you. Dog meat. Come on, boy. You did a good job of holding him, boy. God dang it. Why am I using Kellogg's pistol also? Why am I not using this? Oh no, you are not breaking my legs. Die, you ugly, ugly. Dog meat, for the love of God. Dog. I love you, but you're a pain in the ass sometimes. <sighs> and disintegrate. And disintegrate. And 
I thought I picked up TV dinner tray. Last radius board game. Oh, lovely, a skull. Ooh, blood packs. No, I really don't. I don't have to come out sooner or later. I can smell you out there, little snake. No, no, you can't. Go away. Yay, confetti. More 50 caliber rounds. There is little left here. I am unhappy. Jesus, okay. I think they finally stopped looking for me. Oh, jeez. You know what? That is all for this time, guys. If you enjoyed this episode of us finding out that to, we are rebuilding Liberty Prime, getting back dog meat, coming here, looking for an electromagnet, leave a like, leave a comment, and I will see you dudes next time. Welcome.